we heard before how cell phones can heal people. Before you heal, you need to be able to screen and diagnose and find a problem. That's what Jerry and I have been trying to do, working together for the last four years. In particular, we have been working on the screening and diagnosis of autism. Why do we need to use cell phones for doing that? Jerry is an expert, and she can diagnose a kid around one and a half years old to two years old. In spite of that, the average screening and diagnosis age in the United States is about five and a half years old. So we're about four years late in doing that. That's one example. Let's just look at North Carolina, where our great Duke University is. About 70% of the counties in North Carolina don't have a person capable of doing proper diagnosis of autism. Let's just go a bit abroad, where we are now in Africa. Africa has about half a billion children and only 50 specialists capable of doing proper diagnosis. There is no way the current health system will scale up. Duke University and Duke Health got together with us and about 30 very brilliant people meeting almost every Wednesday in the mornings at Gross Hall, room 318, if you want to come by, and trying to see how we can put inside a cell phone the knowledge that Jerry and others have. That's what we're trying to do. We already installed the app in Duke Pediatrics. You can download the app from the App Store. Over 13,000 families have done that already. And I will be very happy to demo it for you if you come to see us. Before that, let's go back to President Broadhead for his last remarks. Thank you.